Hey G-Squad, welcome back to another episode of Is It Worth It? So for today's episode, we have this cool, amazing product right here in my hand. If you can see, it's by the brand called SwitchBot. If you know what this is, it's a smart switch uh, pusher that you can use to turn on and off the either lights, or your devices, your products, or whatever. But first thing first is actually open up the product first to show you what the product looks like and what is provided inside. So basically what they provide us is a little uh, piece of paper with a quick starter guide right here. And then here is the actual product itself. So this is basically what the product looks like. Let's remove this part first. So it has a little logo right there, SwitchBot. And then there's this part right here that you need to remove or else it will not work. And then right here, you guys can see this is where the pusher is to activate the product to, by pushing it automatically. And then right here in the back, you guys have the option to stick it on to the actual product on where you guys want to stick it on. So you guys can see inside, they do provide some extra accessory if you guys need to use these as well. So basically how you guys set the product up is by pairing it onto the actual app itself, which is called a SwitchBot app. So if you guys see on the app itself, this is basically what it looks like right here. So all you guys need to do is push the button one time and then activate the part right here and see. So basically what you guys want to do is like hook this part right here and attach this part for the actual light switch itself onto the actual light and this part right here will actually pull it to actually close it or open it. So I'll show you guys how to set up that in a second, but let me show you guys how to replace the battery. So all you guys have to do is open this part right here like this. And as you see, that's the battery inside. So that's how you guys replace the battery if you guys need to. So that's basically everything that's on the product itself. Really easy to use and everything. You guys can set up the actual product itself on like the different password, the schedule, the cloud service. Uh, if you guys want to pair it to a remote. And I believe you guys can actually pair it onto like Alexa or Google Home device as well. So you guys can use that option to like turn off and on the actual product itself. So that's basically everything that's on the product itself. Let me actually show you guys a quick test of the product to show you guys how it works and everything. And then we'll come back and talk more about the product in a second. All right, so we got the product right here. As you can see, we have it all set up. So I don't want to tape it on yet because I want to just try it out first. So I'm going to turn off the light first. And then I'm going to click the button that's on the app. So I'm going to click the button. You can see that it works. But obviously, since it's only going one way, you guys will need to add an add-on if you guys want to close back up like this. So if you guys go to your settings for the actual product itself, you click on the mode button. You guys can change the different mode for like the press mode or switch mode. So if you guys use the press mode, then I just press the button using the actual switch itself. But if you guys use the switch mode, you guys can use it to turn off and on using the add-on option. So I have the switch mode set up and everything. Let's give it a try and see how it works. So first thing you guys want to do is remove the adhesive part of the tape itself. And you guys want to tape it onto the switch. So just tape it onto this part right here. Alright, so just stick it on like that. And then you guys want to stick the actual product itself right here. So as you can see on the app itself, this is what it looks like. So I have the option to turn off and on the switch. So I want to turn it on. Alright. And if I want to turn it off, just click the off button right here. And then you guys are all set. Alright, welcome back guys. So now you guys saw a quick test of the product itself. You can see that it does work and it works quite well. Really easy to use and everything. Especially for people who are lazy or they don't want to go all the way to close the switch. And then this is actually really helpful to make your life a little bit easier. So that way you can actually turn it off automatically using the switch bot to actually turn it off for you guys. So now that we did a quick unboxing and testing of the product itself, now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for me, honestly, I think these are actually pretty worth it if you guys want one and need one of these, especially if you guys are in a rush or if you guys forget to turn off something, maybe like your light switch or your devices, maybe like a coffee machine or something, then these are actually really worth it. <laughs> but then obviously for those guys who don't want or don't need one or have no need for one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you do need. But other than that, that's pretty much it for a quick unboxing and testing of the product itself. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, do make sure to subscribe, like, and comment down below. And if you guys like this video and you guys want to see more, then make sure to click on that notification in the bottom to be notified of new videos that will be coming up in the future. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace. And then for today's G-Squad fan shout out day we have.